Hey, what's up, y'all? I'm 1000, and this is a special bonus Wednesday episode. I decided to do something a little special. I've been getting a lot of comments about my music, about how I make my music. For those of you who don't know, a lot of the background beats and stuff on my YouTube channel is stuff that I've made. So I figure, let's try making a beat together. I've never made a beat on camera before. We'll see how this goes. Hopefully it doesn't suck. Yeah, special Wednesday episode. I don't know if you guys have been noticing, but I've been putting out a video every Sunday. I kind of started doing that like three months ago. So far, I haven't missed a Sunday. If I'm like traveling for a mural or I'm on the road or something, then I might miss one, but I'm doing my very best. It's really hard, <laughs> but it's going good so far. So this is uh, where I make music. This is where I make videos. This is kind of my work desk. It's dusty. I probably should have like cleaned this before I shot this video. Whatever. Yeah, let me just kind of talk to you a little bit about my gear real quick. At the center of everything is my MacBook Pro. Down here, got some external drives. These are kind of my two main drives, SSD for my video stuff and like a regular Lacey hard drive. That's a lot of my art stuff. This is like a display monitor that I draw on and I don't really use that for music. My regular 27 inch monitor. This is my audio interface. It's a Focusrite 18i8. And this is where you like plug mics in and this is where my speakers are connected. It's sort of like the central hub for all of the sound. This is my Shure SM7B. This is how I record my voiceover. And I don't know. There's that. <laughs> it's on like one of these broadcaster boom arm stands so I can like pull it down when I need it. And then this is my little MIDI controller. It's an Alesis V25. Oh, this is super dusty. <laughs> I totally should have cleaned up before I started. I used to have like a separate studio that I rented and I had like a room full of gear. I had like tons of mics and preamps and just, you know, I was ready to record like a band and I had just like all this gear. But now I just have this keyboard, this audio interface, this mic, and like that's totally enough for me and I've really 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 kind of pared down my whole setup and it feels super good and super liberating and that's everything I use. Uh, I make all my beats in a program called Pro Tools. It's what I use. There's lots of different stuff that you can use. As far as my musical past, I always did music since I was like 14 years old, from like 14 to 27. And then in my late 20s, I kind of just started making art and then it started going really good. And the music to me now is like something I just do for fun. It's almost like art and music have like flip-flopped because music used to be like my career. Yeah, let's jump into this beat, son. So Pro Tools makes you like name your session before you even start it. So I just usually like make up a weird name on the spot and then that is like forever what the beat is called. So we'll call this one Snow Flares. Cause it's super snowy outside. Alright, Snow Flares it is. Alright, start. I'm gonna just create a master track here. First things first and an instrument track. And I'm the type of beat maker where I like to actually start with like a melody first. Set my BPM to like 92.
not feeling that snare and I'm not feeling that shaker. So I think I'll probably change that. Yeah, it's going good so far. Kind of more vibey, moody. A lot of my beats I'm trying to make a little bit more cinematic because most of my beats are for videos now. So uh, I have a lot of like big bombastic high energy stuff already made that I use a lot, but um, maybe this one will be a little more vibey. We'll see, yeah. Chop it, chop it, chop it, chop it. All right, got my samples. Got my samples, son. Let's bring some of this stuff in. Ooh, baby, making beats is fun to do, but making beats on camera is kind of stressful. Cause it's gotta be real good. Yeah, 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 that's what we looking for, some crunchy, juicy snares. Let's see what's up with some kicks. Yeah. And then this is my baby. Ooh. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Skip all that reverb stuff. Sounded cheesy. And then this big boy, let's drop this big boy in. Woo! Just like once every. Uh, uh. Bring in a little, a little snare roll. Woo, that's fire. transition Thank you. 
instrument of its kind in the world. But this is my show. Make me move. Keep me up. Hip it. Something. Hip it. This is my show. Well, this is a beat. I'll probably keep vibing it out for a little bit and see where it goes. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is a weird one. This is just, I felt like doing it and it's not art, but you know, I just kind of wanted to put this little thing together. I'm gonna upload this to my SoundCloud if you guys wanna hear like the actual real version. Uh, like this video if you like this kind of thing. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you want a lot more art videos, not so much music videos. <laughs> but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you guys on the next one.